since we're talking about you and, and Jeju, um, it's interesting that in like the last week or so, he it's been um, his He's party been setting and his himself. Admin up. Yeah, yeah well, he's setting up like his uh, administration. Yeah. And uh, Yoon tapped former Jeju governor Wang Hee Rung to be the minister of land transport, which is interesting. Um, uh, mind boggling, but yeah, no, no, so, no, it's not mind boggling because I you could for, foresee it coming. But hmm. uh, for anyone, what that, are your first thoughts on this? Because I, oh, I, I have a, I have a couple, of course. So what are your thoughts? Before. My listen, I've met uh, Juan numerous times over the year, and I, he is an yep. extremely likable person. He's yep. very vibrant. Uh, he he's real active in the community. When I met him many times, he, he you know he has he has a presence. Yeah, uh, not a fan of the politics. Yeah. Not a fan of how uh, what has happened on Jeju under his administration. Mm. But yeah. yeah, and so for him to be in in particular this in particular this title <laughs> this particular. Mm -hmm seats that he will be filling you're just mm -hmm. like well there we go there yeah. we go there uh, have we go. i mentioned that he's from jungmoon my uh current i did not know resident. that yeah I yeah he was a big know. shot okay. here yeah. right so uh, he well, was he, graduated yeah. top of the school and top yep. of everything and he top was, of top he's quite a, he was just a big shop in general that was the first governor that i remember that people really he was kind of like a little superstar down here versus mm. the past governors that i didn't really know much about or didn't have a mm -hmm. real big impact there's always scandal on jj there's always mm. scandal and with him as well but he's uh he's kind of like a he was i mean I he was uh -huh. he was well known of, of the previous three uh governors because one of them was governor for like five freaking terms right yes uh, he was forever and ever and ever amen and he's now escaped to canada because he's wanted on <laughs> Yeah, that, that's pretty. Yeah. yeah, well, people people that don't realize Jeju is just a, a hotbed of scandals. Like you think America or you think, you know, like other places that Jeju is like drama. There could be a yeah. reality show about the Jeju scandals. But Juan himself has partaken in uh, mm. quite a few scandals, which is why I'm a little disappointed, uh -huh. which, you know, you could go into further detail well, about. Yeah, I'm not. Well, it's interesting because I had two thoughts when I heard that yeah. he was because he ran for he was he ran for, ran president, for president and yeah. lost in the primary. And to run, he he resigned from governor to, yeah. to try to get this in the middle of COVID. Yeah. Which is everyone loved that. <laughs> um, and, you know, the Korean Herald reported that his nomination is a huge surprise, saying that, like, he doesn't have expertise in land development or anything like that which i thought was weird because that is like, weird because jeju <laughs> look around jeju all the development that uh has happened is because uh -huh. he allowed it to happen and he signed yeah. deals with so many different companies to to uh pave jeju under and my theory my theory this is like i don't have any proof to support this so let's caveat that is that okay. when he joined the yoon administration uh the yoon uh, as a senior advisor the yoon campaign I wonder if that was like a stipulation, like let me be the Ministry of Land, because that's often happens. You get you like, do get you know, something for throwing your transport. Support. Yeah, absolutely. That's, and yeah, so, so you think that was part of it? I think specifically the Ministry of Land, right? Because he wants to probably make a push, push for president, uh, president five or ten years from now, and it's it's what he did during the campaign is he so it's it's it's. Crazy because you know, e, uh, e. J. Myung was the competitor, right? And uh, mm. Juan led a campaign like this, kind of trying to make a scandal of E, saying he was involved oh. in this twenty five. Yeah, it's kind of complicated. Oh, it's right. like a land. He accused. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. Well, he was building on accusations that other people yes. made when he was the yes. mayor of Songnam. I think I have yes. my notes down here. I should check that. And yes. He and like in the lead up days before the election, one was like, I have this satchel and in this satchel and I'm dramatizing. He didn't yes, do yeah, any yeah, of yeah. that, but he, <laughs> he, he got all these he, documents that apparently further incriminated uh, Lee and the satchel came from to the party, the People's Party, the Conservative Party, from an anonymous person who found this bag by a sewer grate by a highway. <laughs> and Juan was like, some of the pages are damaged. And it's, it's, oh, I'm telling you, that's what I mean when I say mm. it could be an actual uh, reality show. It yeah. could be an actual reality yeah. show. Yeah. But he, we should, so I think with him, 
mm-hmm. coming with the airport, it's yeah. a done deal. It's a done that, deal. You, that's my first thought a, too. The airport getting built. A hundred and ten percent. There is. I always knew it was going to get built, right? Like I knew yeah. it, but now I feel like we just fast forwarded. There's yeah. not even going to be any more talk. I can, you know, like I, uh. I predict it's going to happen even very soon. Really? Okay. Okay. Yeah, I, so I, yeah. Okay. So I, I, I did a little bit of not research, but like reading and tried to gather some stuff because this is actually a really pivotal time in the airport. Mm-hmm. Um. So oh. just to to get people back on track, the airport, the environment ministry kind of kiboshed the airport plan back in July yep. See, due to <laughs> environmental concerns, you know, like threat, it'll threaten animals that per- currently at whatever, currently at whatever, yeah. currently endangered of extinction. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, there were kind of, it's not like kiboshed completely, just that plan no. was come back, revise it. Give, that plan is due in June. Now, oh, right around the uh, corner. And the residents of Sungsan, those who support the airport, actually had a press conference when oh. uh, one was announced. And they said that he's the most qualified person for this Ministry of Land uh, position, right? And they want, it's, it's, it's fascinating. And especially as an outsider, sort of as an outsider. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you mean. Yeah. Because it's, it's, it's like Gangjong again, because the Gallup poll, found that 65% of Songsan residents want the airport. But 47% of Jeju people don't. Don't want it, right. Which right. is where it, it is really half and half, um, which is really interesting. Yeah. But 43% of people said they want it, right, of Jeju. Right. But right. that's a large majority of people in Songsan that don't want it. And yeah. it's... And and one does. It's been a thing that he's been pushing. So absolutely. I mean, he. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and but like I said, I just I feel like that was the last nail in the coffin for yeah. uh, you know, and and must be felt. JG wide, like the protesters might must have just been like, oh righty then, you know, because honestly, it that's it. It's it. So yeah, I'll be. I, I will. You know, I'll um eat my eat my shoe if come later but i really as soon as i heard that announcement that that's what his position was i was like well all right there we go there we go and my i think he's going to use it to run for because i honestly i think i objectively monetarily yeah the airport will be a success when it's built oh of course of course but you know for the locals and for like when i think about it i'm like oh my god can you imagine having to go down there to get off the well i guess it's different for you but you know the whole cities are based around Mm -hmm. the airport right getting the you know the the business hotels the business office tells the Mm -hmm. everything is based around the location so now this will just it will be a whole thing uh, they want to it's part of a bigger like development plan they're going to build this like oh. it's going to become a big oh, city it's, it's there. going to be a huge thing right? yeah and yeah. it's just going to change the dynamics completely of how the island operates what town is it'll be really interesting too to see with um tourism now will be opening back up and i i think they said come may right yeah that we won't be walking around with even if you have covid you can just mm walk around anyways we're about (laughs) to see tourism pick back up even international tourism it will be picking up and that's just going to change the dynamics of shinjeju Mm -hmm. you know of all you know that city was built around the airport and you know the the pedestrian mall and all Mm -hmm. that it's the whole i the whole dynamics of the island will be changing i should know this off the top of my head but is that going to be the international terminal terminal or the domestic no that's no my my well I, I fear saying no. I think that what, what the issue is that that's going to be the domestic terminal. Right. Which is interesting. I thought they were going to make that the, well, I'll have to look into that. I, that's we really should look into quickly that before to we steal figure our, that out. Yes. Right? Our listeners it, wrong. But I remember that that's what, but it has gone back and forth. But mm. I remember thinking, well, this is just going to be getting to an airport just to go to, you know, Seoul or Busan is going to be. That would, that would suck. Ridiculous. Yeah, that would totally suck. So, yeah. And imagine how many more rental cars will be on Jeju I, when oh, that I thing gets even, built. Don't even, <laughs> I, for whatever reason, yesterday, excuse my language listeners it was a shit show on the roads yesterday it was oh you know my pearls, it was, it was, my pearls. <laughs> it was and you can now see like anyways the tourists were always coming down through covid but for yeah. whatever reason yesterday was just i was the whole time i was in my car i was just like just get home just get home just get home <laughs> don't yell at your window alexis <laughs> 
<laughs> keep your keep your hands on the wheel, Alexis. Uh-huh. 